About a half million Minnesotans have Swedish roots, but some don't actually know much about the country or heritage. Swedish public television took that idea and then turned it into a wildly popular reality show. Everything for Sweden is the translated title. The show puts Americans with Swedish roots deep into culture, facing challenges and obstacles. As Susan Elizabeth Littlefield shows us, a Minneapolis woman came home with a lot more than a prize. Sally Franson has a story many a Minnesotan can identify with. She has Scandinavian roots. The fact that I was Swedish, I would say, it was always kind of burbling in the back, partly because I look Swedish, partly because I live in Minnesota. It was a casual connection until last fall. A friend had suggested she apply for a popular Swedish show that submerges Swedish descendants into their motherland. Sally, a writer and English teacher at McAllister, made the cut. The joke with the production team, if you put a Swede on reality TV and you say, oh, what was that experience like? They'll say, it was good. And, and you ask an American, what was that experience like? Oh my God, you know, they're laughing, they're crying. And boy, did she go through all the emotions. She faced one Swedish challenge after another. I had to go orienteering through the woods, which is a very Swedish activity. I had to memorize 30 Swedish songs in 30 minutes and then be able to tell the host of the show what date they had become a hit. I was actually pretty good at that one. She's being humble. She was essentially the best. After months of challenges, she was one of two grand prize winners. As a reward, producers found her distant relatives. I round the corner of this hedge and I see 15 people who all look like me, you know, opening their arms to hug me. Um, I mean, that's joy, you know, that's what what joy is, and uh, I'll never ever forget that feeling. There was no cash prize involved, but for Sally from Minnesota, the payoff was huge. I had the opportunity of a lifetime. Um, I didn't understand how profound it would be until it happened to me. Susan Elizabeth Littlefield, WCCO 4 News. The show wrapped in December, but the finale just aired. Since her trip, Sally has become quite close with her newfound family. How great is that? And it's great. You could tell, too, she's yes, very emotional about she's it. She's very so. touched. I got a little choked up watching yeah. that, yeah. Well, congratulations. <laughs>